like starting the trip up a hill. Hey, here we are walking in on Friday afternoon. We're on the uh, Tecumseh Trail. We're gonna link up with the Panther Creek Trail and uh, go into where we're gonna be camping for this evening. There's several people. A uh, small group went ahead and there's four of us in our group. And uh, it's a beautiful day. So I'm uh, gonna we'll film from time to time and I'll give you an idea of what we got here. Like we had a uh, wind event here. It continues on up the hill. Here we are at camp, and everybody is picking out their tree and getting ready to set up. Their hammocks. And there's Acer's set up. Really, if I just and there's Acer. Yeah, two pieces of PVC with a huge shotgun reds. That's red sitting down there. I should have I should have made it inside out. That's man cat. <laughs> and there's man cat in the kilt. I already wear a kilt when I'm backpacking. I'm not really worried so much about the little things. So. And now I'm like, well, I'm not really to make a new head. And there's mules set up with the bridge hammock and the Cuban tarp. And of course, there's the mule. And there's his son, Jimmy. I did not. And Jimmy's setup is right there. Let's see what we got over here. There's our cam 77, his new setup. And with his best side turned to us over there is uh, Hanger for Life and his setup. And last but not least, there's my setup. And that's itty bitty. So you just put it on gentle cycle so the agitation isn't that bad? You put it by itself? couldn't even walk in a damn village when I was there. Well, when was that though? 68. Yeah, show the front of that. So were you there after the Ted of 68? Yeah, but see, until 69. You know, when those Marines got home, that's when they started raising hell about me lying. <laughs> and anybody would believe them then, you know. You are showing your age with that hit. <laughs> what the hell does that mean? <laughs> See, Saki's not very high in alcohol either. It's not? No, about like wine. Is it? 
The stuff I had in Taiwan was so terrible. I never thought I'd ever drink soft again. It was awful. And it was free. You like some, like, bees and shit going in. Yeah, when I went to R&R &R duty, cool drink all you want. They just had sake bottles mm -hmm. all over the place. That's why I wasn't no good. That's right. Mm -hmm. And I didn't think I'd like it. We went to this Japanese restaurant, and I got a bottle, and I loved it. Which yeah. Japanese restaurant? Taku or something like that. Because we went to this um, Thai restaurant downtown. It's the only time I've ever had sake. And it was terrible. Like, I, I, I couldn't stand it. No kidding. You got yeah. sake from a Thai restaurant? That might be the problem. Possibly. <laughs> that might be the problem. It might have been like uh, dish water or something. <laughs> dish water well, and rubbing alcohol. They might have even watered it down and re recorked it. Well, it was my it was my birthday and I, we were looking, you know, on the on the menu. I was like, oh, they have sake. I'll try it. Yeah, it was not very good. Well, the sake is good. What do you think? It was good. Sake. That they that they give you just a little cup of it? No, a little shot. We brought a whole bag. Oh, really? <laughs> was it cold? That was so wrong. <laughs> no shit. Yeah, and then the other stuff they gave like, you, man, they just had squeezed all the stuff out. They just like, oh yeah, that's sucky. What? They squeezed you? Oh yeah. Yeah, they kept waiting on Jimmy to say he had enough. He, he, didn't figure, <laughs> he was he, like, he didn't figure that out, and he was starting to get worried. <laughs> I said, he's waiting on you to tell him you had enough. Oh my god. <laughs> you carried him out, right? <laughs> That's a fun place to eat. <coughs> Man, <coughs> I'm drinking this stuff again. I gotta have something to blow my nose with. He was calling the uh, <coughs> chicken uh, Japanese meow meow. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, this is some Japanese meow meow. Well, he looks like he's 73. <laughs> I was trying to be kind. That's because I quit shaving the other day. <laughs> the other day? Take me a month to grow that. About two weeks ago. They were having a discussion on Bob and Tom earlier, and I didn't. I only missed I missed the second half of it. They said they're the top three cities of all the 50 states uh, that were, you know, good for hippies to live in, and in, in one of the cities was in the state of Indiana, but I didn't catch what state it was, or city it was. Oh, really? Bloomington? Uh, yeah. They changed the law. Last, last year. Last year. Last year. Okay. Last year. Okay. Last year. Okay. And the boat right. shot right out of the bed. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I've like, got the arrow on it. I already know. Of course you can. It was a mule fart. It sounded like it was right next to me. I flew my boy. That's a ventrilo fart. The what now? Have Jim say it. Tell me, Jim. That'd be the only problem with having Jim. And finally, he'll work out. And he was like, you just seen him just stop working all the time. What the hell is going on? Hey, day two. Several of us are going to uh, bushwhack back up to the trail and then head on back to the vehicles and uh, do a little restocking. So, it's basically just a, a good day hike. Well, no, she'll, she'll make them whatever colors or whatever you want on them. I think I know it's mine. Oh, okay. Fire. Fire. I think I know it's mine. I think I know it's mine. I think I know it's mine. I remember the first one. Right. I remember drawing this elaborate plan for everybody and what else I had there. And like showing the layers and the complexity of how society really is. This has really turned out to be a neat spot. Yeah, that's very much. 
You know, I, I have my doubts, man, when mules started bushwhacking down there on the street. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> Everybody, I said to mule, you know, I said, hey, you want a machete? He kind of looked at me and he goes, no, but I got plenty of birds all over me. Yeah, he was having a fit with those birds. And I looked at all, looked at all those birds and I thought, uh -huh. I ain't walking through that shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we, we can take a lot. It's scary, so. I think your buddy was behind me. I think you and David were in here. It's going to be probably Make double at no time. Yeah, we're waiting for you to start off and get too damn. Nice. Can we please stop? Seriously? That's not That's about. Just about. <laughs> In about 45 minutes, we'll stop. One more. Are you fine for you, Mr. Thomas? No. 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 This, is not, this has nothing to do with my professional opinion. This is just totally my personal. Safety. Dude, I burned a tire as I was a kid. This shit don't even compare to burning a tire. Just stop. Please. For the love of God. For the love of God. To the lake. In the parking lot, right on that edge, you'll see a trail straight heading up. straight up. It's not all that bad. Yeah, but coming from this way, we didn't see. We walked through a lot of stuff that was like up to our place. Yeah. I mean, just grass and all kinds of junk, so it was well, hard that, to find any discernible trail. You saw on your maps with Miller Ridge up mm -hmm. there. That, that takes you right up to Miller Ridge, and uh, that's a lot. There's a lot. Well, of, uh, we're kind of having breakfast before we hit yeah. the trail yeah, to. Uh, in the uh, weekend hike and hang. Uh, let me think a minute. No, not for it's a long time. a good time. weekend, no. though. No. Okay. Another successful mission. All righty, here we are getting ready to leave. Everybody's left. We're the last ones to go. And as you can see, other than our new fire pit for next time, we're leaving it exactly the way we found it, if not better. So. And here's the crew that's hiking out. We got Hanger for life, paint, RCAM 1977, and trail medic. So we're heading to the trailhead.